With the end of No Game No Life comes in Ari Furetu to fill the slot. Now, I hear that this is a prequel that I need to watch. It's like five or six minutes long. Let's make it a quick one and then we get into episode one. Let's begin. School, high school bell. This and the cicada noises during the summer are probably the mo most reused clips. Are we getting bullied? Wait, you sure? Yes, maybe. What the fuck? I, 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 I'm getting called out personally. Oh, hello. Not you. Not you guys. No, Nagumo. Fuck you. Now, why does this care about... Why does she care about the fucking virgin neat weeb, huh? Why? Because you guys are the target audience for this show. <laughs> Get fucked, dude. Get fucked. <laughs> why does she care so much about the main character? What? The two goddesses? <laughs> the two of them though? Oh, wait, wait. Who, who's the other one? Because you're the main character. Oh, damn. Who are these two? Is that the other goddess? The guy on the right reminds me of Jimonji. Advantage? She just came here. She's a little... Fuck off. <laughs> why does she care though? No, no, no. No, why do you care about Nagumo though? You know, the most popular girl, one of the two goddesses at school just happens to love unconditionally this virgin neat weeb. Why? Where's the isekai? Isn't this an isekai? Are we staying in Japan? <laughs> this teacher's a lolly? Of course the teacher's a lolly. <laughs> She's so tiny. Isekai time? Isekai time? Isekai time? Oh? The entire class thing gets transported? Okay, no truck coming. Just magical summoning. Getting summoned by castle? Are they like summoning heroes? Probably. <laughs> this is like a gacha game and they just summoned a bunch of fucking three-star units. No five-star here, bro. <laughs> maybe the two goddesses, maybe the girl. The MC just looks like such a weak piece of shit. Okay, just summon the heroes, beat the demons. All right, that's their typical isekai shit, right? Okay. Status and humor. I bet the main character is going to have like a zero or like a question mark, right? Because, you know, I don't know, he's got to be an anomaly or something like that. Combat and non-combat, okay. You want to be combat, but we're going to be non-combat, right? One out of 10,000 might be combat? He's a hero summer? Wow. <laughs> ah, we don't want we don't want to be blacksmith. No, no. I want to be like a sword god. I want to be like sword saint, you know? <laughs> no, he's gonna be a shitty job, right? He's gonna be what is this job, bro? What is he? Job synergist. Crafting. <laughs> What is this shit? No! There's gotta be a- No, 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 no! There's gotta be an OP reason! Also... The fuck? The lolly teacher came with us? Look at the lolly teacher! It would have been hilarious if the lolly teacher was a combatant, right? She's a farmer? <laughs> She's a farmer? <laughs> what are these random jobber classes, dude? Alright, interesting premise, right? I think episode one doesn't explain any of this shit. So it's like a bunch of high school kids. It's, it's class that's got transported and it's this isekai world. Basically, defeat the demons. It's, it's, it's as simple as that. But the interesting thing is like the different classes, like one in 10,000, all these different rare shits going on, non-combatant, combatants. I'm sure the bullies and all the other shitty people are going to get cool shit, but then we are going to get left with like a shitty, shitty job, quote unquote. But remember... How do shows like this hype us up? By making people look down on the main character with a seemingly useless job or skill, but it turns out he's actually the strongest for whatever fucking reason. We'll find out soon enough. But hey, if you're still here, if you did enjoy this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.